Welcome everyone. Today is Disneyland's 66th anniversary. Mm -hmm. So we are in Napa Rose. We're going to celebrate Disneyland's anniversary or birthday as we like to say. It's celebrating 66 wonderful years. Obviously last year we couldn't celebrate because it was closed but we're here to celebrate. We're here to just enjoy the magic and have a delicious dinner. Yep. I'm also wearing my 60th anniversary bracelet. I don't wear it much just because it's really special. I got it during the 60th anniversary. So I only I only bring it up for the fancy occasions. <laughs> we just order, we are gonna get, get a delicious meal. You got the prefix menu. Yes. And then I order a la carte and then he's gonna surprise us with our wine. I'm just I'm just so happy we're here. We're gonna celebrate, we're gonna have a great time, we're gonna enjoy and thank you all for building this magical place, the happiest place on earth. Yep. Let's celebrate and let's enjoy some delicious dinner. All right, you then. Rose away. Okay, so here's our first pairing. And we also had some sparkling water. I don't know if I, I if I mentioned that. We'll show the rest as it comes out. Okay, I present you the smiling tiger salad. These are lobster and shrimp fritties. And then it's part of your four course meal, right? Yes. The I think kapachi. Kapachi, there you go. Yes. Looks delicious, super fresh. And that is the watermelon underneath it. Delicious. So the broth that they put. They actually pour it on top. Yeah, they pour it on. That is supposed to be the spice part of it, like the spice part of it. All right. Here we go. We have some spicy beef here in the bottom. Good choice. Yes. And then we have some sriracha. Let's check the fritters. Lobster and shrimp, you can't go wrong. I think I'll be nice and I'll give you a little taste of it. Thank you. Just a little bit. I see how it is. There's a little bit of a spice in there. I mean, obviously, if you have the sriracha, there's more. It's really good. It's really fresh. Let me try yours. That's super fresh. You're really gonna like that. Yeah. I can't. I can't paint out the the flavors of the broth though. Gotcha. There is some oil in it. Like a vinaigrette. It's really good though. You have to try that. All right. Well, I think he did an excellent job pairing the wine. It's like a dry wine. Um, it's, it's from Germany. I can't pronounce the name, <laughs> but it's a German wine. It's it's dry. It's really good. Compliments well. I thought it was wasabi that was on top of your um, watermelon with the little radishes. It's actually avocado. Mm. So. It's, it's really, really good, really refreshing. My salad was delicious, guys. We're off to a good start. Yep. Now, coming up next for me is the pot pie, and for you? It is the rabbit bratwurst. You guys know presentation is key. Presentation is everything. This is beautiful. I love how it's presented. Now it has a flaky crust, and it is a chicken pot pie. Okay, look at this. Look at the beautiful presentation. It has a oh, flaky crust. Let's try the broth by itself. So there's the chicken. There's some veggies in there. Definitely not over salty like how other pot pies are. Yeah. Very, very good. We have some celery, as I can see, some potatoes in there. The chicken, you're gonna like this one. It's nice and hot like it's supposed to be. <laughs> and it comes with a little copper pan. Mm -hmm. Presentation is key. It's a little hard to get a piece of the shell, but you guys get the idea. Oh, there you go. Yeah. 
So not so much like getting inside a pie, mostly like just just the, the top, top. Just yeah, the, top. The, the cover. All right, ready? There's the chicken, some veggies. Here's the top. It's gonna be a hot bite. <laughs> yep. It's very very good. Definitely, I feel like it's reduced with some with wine or something because yeah. it does have a little bit of that that taste on it. Gotcha. All right. So yours, you have the rabbit bratwurst. Yes. And it comes with potato salad. Yes. With I mustard. Will, I will try your potato salad. All right. But I'm not trying the bratwurst. Come on. I, I can't do it. Sorry, guys. You have to. See, it won't taste bad with the rabbit bread worse. Alright, your more, turn. It's more brat than worst. It's actually in a cast iron plate, which is really cool. Here's that feel, and I try to figure out what's the red. Ooh, the sauce? It's, it it kind of looks like a raspberry vinaigrette, to be honest. It, it, I think it is. You have some mustard seeds there. Oh, there it is. That's the mustard he was talking about. Oh, that's gonna pop. Okay, thank you. Alright. Alright. You're gonna get some mustard on it or? How comes a little knife, a little pointy knife? Ah, off it. There you go. Nailed it. You can get more. No, I just want, I just want to be easy, like, try it. Rabbit bratwurst. Mm -hmm. Very light, like you. Yeah. I see. It's light, like chicken, like light. Um, the how you don't feel heavy as, as like a like a beef. A beef or a pork. It's light as chicken. It looks delicious. Well, rabbits tend to be lean. Uh, as potato. Very interesting with the potato salad. Feels like missing salt. It's missing a little flavor, but it's good. It's nice and fresh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. the uh, actually right here is better. Same with my Popeye. It's missing a little bit of salt, but it's 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 doable just because um, it's hearty, but it's a light hearty type of uh, Popeye. I was saying it's like a, um, I don't know, I feel like it's like a raspberry vinegar or raspberry jam or something like that. Oh, okay. It's like a little thick. I it, was going to say more like just a raspberry jam. Yeah. So this again is part of the four course meal. Yes. This part is the four course meal. Yeah. It was this or the, and now we write description below. Yes. We'll show you the menu again, guys. That way you guys can see what, what we're eating and what we're having. Oh no, I remember. It was this or the pot pie. Oh, so you could actually try best of both worlds. Yep. All right, give it a go. Try this one. All righty. Careful, it might be a little hot. I'm trying. Give it. Cut it. Sister. Yeah. First try. First try. You got it. Ready? Go for it. All right. Hmm. Not your average papaya. No, it's very different. It's not like a creamy one. That's a very citrusy uh, plate. Has a very citrusy uh, taste to it. Mm -hmm. Again, um, I have the citronelle. You have the shiraz, and I do love a good shiraz, and that is definitely a good shiraz. <laughs> <laughs> Stop making fun of me. You're eyeing it. <laughs> I know. The papaya is really good. Yeah, you like it. Uh, See, best of both worlds now. Yep. It's very different from ordinary pot pie. It has like a like a certain taste, like a Thanksgiving pot pie. Yeah, like Thanksgiving because pie. it has the like rosemary sage type of. It's more like a broth pot pie. Broth, there you go. Like compared a broth. to like a creamy pot yeah, pie. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so let's finish this and then we'll bring our next course. Okay, so here we have my filet mignon. It has tomatoes, avocado, and cheddar with potatoes on the side. I asked for mine for uh, to be done well done. You guys know that I like my meat well done. And then my brother has the New York steak. Yes. Your New York steak came with bacon. Oh, you did? Oh, I see it. Bacon and some veggies in the bottom. Yep. And an onion. And some onion. Delicious. Right, 
Let's try it. Alright. Okay. First, let me try the potatoes. Alright. They are, ooh, they're thick. I think you're gonna enjoy that. How thick are they? They're cheddar thick. <gasps> Please let it be well done. Please let it be well done. <laughs> It's not well done, but I can live with it. <laughs> it's never red. It's, it's, still, no it's still red. They're yeah. no for their rosy meats. It's mooing at me. It's really good for the meal. These? At least they take a jump. Not a big fan of the, the tomatoes there. Okay. <laughs> Love it. I have to flip you so I can eat it. <laughs> See, like that, I, that's, I'm fine with. I can eat it like that. But when juices are still coming out, I can't. I'm sorry. Don't hate me. <laughs> I just can't. Oh, yours has a really nice herb to it. Like, like a chimichurri on it. Hmm. <gasps> I might switch with you. <laughs> All right. Let's see that piece of meat. Ish. There you go. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so much better. <laughs> Adding this with the bacon and the broth it gives it a, such a delicious flavor to it. Holy smokes. This is better. Wow. I'm a silly piece. Yeah, All right, I'll try it. So this is the wine that they recommend us for each of our meal courses mm -hmm. for our steaks. Hands down, yours is better. <laughs> so I traded my steak only because mine's so mooly right there. But yeah, your steak was better. It was well done. The potatoes are good, but um, I try to save my carbs for something else. But overall, I think it was delicious. Now, we still haven't uh, placed an order for dessert. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get the peach uh, peach pie, and yes. then you're going to get the bomboli. Yes. So I'm excited to see what that is. How are the potatoes? Very good. I like them. Yeah? They do have cheese in it, like, like some sort of cheddar. Yeah, white cheddar. Yeah. And also, the steak is exclusive to the um, the course meal. And then mine was for the entree. Yeah. For the a la carte dish. And dessert has arrived. So this is part of, I think there's summer um, dessert menu. It's a peach um, tart with peach sorbet and some peaches there and blackberries. It looks delicious. I will say I think I have a better dessert compared to my brother's. <laughs> but I think he has the bambolini. I'm excited to try that too but oh let's give this one a go. This looks delicious. Okay. So when I saw this in the menu I was really excited for it. They also have a chocolate cake but I thought mm, we could get a chocolate cake later. delicious. That, that is, is a peach sorbet and it's amazing. It is sorbet. It looks like more like the what do you call it? More like a buttery feel like that. So that's right a here. peach tart. We have peaches there. Peach sorbet. Oh my god the peach sorbet is amazing. <laughs> the tart's not bad but the sorbet is way superior than anything. Okay, so I think it's blackberry filled because I see some um, dark where? Fruit. Right In there. In here? Yeah. So it's like peach tart with um blackberry. Blackberries. I was gonna say what is this right here? Is like a, that's a like peach slice? Yes. A dehydrated peach slice. Oh, okay. Wait, it sounds crispy. Is it peach slice? It's a dehydrated peach slice. Oh okay. So there you go. So yeah, your peach tart, peach um um, diced peach, peach sorbet, and dehydrated peach. We have some um, blueberries. Blueberries. And this is vanilla ice cream. Vanilla ice cream. And I can't remember what's that one. I think they said it was corn. Mm. They look 
little donuts. Yeah. Filled with 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 um, sweet corn. Mm -hmm. That is a better dessert. That's all I'm gonna say. It's not bad. The vanilla ice cream is just like regular vanilla ice cream. Yeah. Um, it tastes more like a sweet cream ice cream. The blueberries um, right here. They're pretty good. They're they're nice and sweet. And the sweet corn is not bad, but I'm not a I'm not a fan of sweet corn. Gotcha. So I'm really happy I didn't get the one. Enjoy. <laughs> All right, see. My way. We want to hear what you think. My only two options was the blueberry or the artisan cheese. They do have a lounge here. Gotcha. Uh, it said closed for right now. Yeah. So we're not sure if it how long it's gonna be closed for. Wait, that's what it says. Gotcha. This is delicious. You gotta try some some um, strawberry before I finish it. Alrighty. Okay, guys. So here's my dessert. All I can say is, mine was delicious. Super, super summery, super fresh. Absolutely delicious. That um, sorbet was amazing. If they can sell that, I would buy a pint of it right now. The tart was perfect, but I can live without the tart only because the sorbet was that good. All we're gonna do now is wait for the check and then we'll head outside and then we'll say our goodbyes. Yep. Okay, you guys, and with that, we finished the night. It was a delicious, delicious dinner here in Apple Rose. Happy birthday, Disneyland. We'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to check us out over at Perfect Every Bike. Don't forget the underscores on Instagram. It was a great night. We celebrated, and I will see you next time. Yep. Bye. Let's go the way.